Hey, Mom. Where are you? Wait, what? So you're not coming? But I'm already here. I know, but Mom, don't we owe it to Grandpa to... Yeah, I know. It's just... What? You can't sell the clock? Grandpa's had that for years. Okay. Okay. Whatever. It's fine. I can just start clearing out my boxes and then... I don't know. We can come back tomorrow and do the rest? Yeah. Bye. I'm really going to miss you, Grandpa. All right. Let's do this. A desk drawer. A desk drawer. Oh, Grandpa's old travel diary. Seems like a few pages are missing. A desk drawer. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. Could this be one of the diary pages? I should see if I can find the missing pages before- I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. A tape recorder. Hello. This is Howard James Wright with a message for my granddaughter, Sarah Elizabeth Wright. So if anyone else is listening, they can start off immediately, please. <laughs> <clears throat> Sarah, if you are listening to this, then it means... Well, it means I'm gone. But I don't want you to be too sad about it. That's just the way life goes sometimes. So, chin up, my little pixie. Remember our grand moments. All the adventures we had when you were a little one and I wasn't such a cranky old man. I, I know you have questions for me. It's true I kept secrets from you and your mother. But there were good reasons. There are things in this world greater than ourselves and I needed to protect you from them. I didn't want either of you to face the dangers that I've had to... I never wanted to place such a burden on your shoulders, but now it... it's unavoidable. Pixie, I need your help. But I can't just tell you. I have to show you. You will need to see for yourself. This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest river, in every breath of wind and every dancing flame, all you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. I love you very much. Goodbye, Grandpa. Hey, Mr. Piggles. My grandfather's grandfather clock. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a... It's locked. It needs a key to open. A typewriter? Nah. I don't feel like reading up on... There's no one to play. And... I'm not sure I even know the proper rules. It's an old table lamp. It's a small, simple key. Maybe it fits the desk. 
Fuse. Se oh, okay. Does this globe have anything to do with Grandpa's message? No, that's not it. That doesn't seem to be it. Yeah! <laughs> I did it! This looks like... Is this a second part of my necklace? Whoa! Whoa. Serious whoa. Nah. I can find my way back to the train station without it. Nah, nah. This, this will be perfect! A desk drawer. Locked. Huh. This tin box looks fairly old and has a combination lock. What could the combination- Okay, Grandpa. I need a clue to unlock this box. So if you're here... Huh. Guess I'll have to work it out myself then. Huh. This tin box looks... What could the combination be? A desk drawer. I'm sure some of these are maps. Lots of maps. key I have doesn't fit here. This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest Helen, river. I should see if I can every find breath the of wind and every this. dancing flame. All you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. I love you very much. Grandpa loved this thing. Told me it was one of a kind. Although, he never actually told me why. Yeah. 
Yeah. Enough of that. Ah, uh, the old gr- I'm sure some of these are worth keeping, but I'm not going to- uh, It's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa sure did like his books. He sure could draw, though. I mean, look at that goddess dragon thing. An open desk drawer. Fairies by Brian Froud and Alan Lee. Hmm, the key I have doesn't fit here. It's okay, Greg, it's locked. Oh, damn. I was sure that would be it. Maybe I need something else to solve this. There is no way I can pick this up. Weren't these triangles in the journal pages? This button seems to control what clock hand can be moved. This clock- It won't budge. It won't bu I probably need to select the clock hand somehow. It won't budge.
I pr- It's- It won't budge. It's stuck in place. I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. Oh! Grandpa's old travel diary. Seems like a few pages are missing. These books are all so old. Hey, wait. Is that the biography of George Lucas? The Hero with a Thousand Faces by Joseph Campbell. I'm sure some of these are worth keeping, but I'm not going to sit down and sort through them right now. <laughs> 